Hiya guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Um, thanks for stopping by. My name's Elaine and I'm here today with a little haul. So I have been to Home Bargains and I popped in Poundland, otherwise known as the Pound Shop. Um, and I had a little quick pop in to B&M as well to see what they had. So without further delay, I'm going to jump in and show you exactly what I've bought this time round. I've got my tea here in my cup today, which is don't let the muggles get you down. And it's a Hogwarts one. So first up is these glasses. So they are tumblers, little tumbler glasses. They've got a lovely kind of pattern to them they're not crystal the cut glass but I would say that they're really quite good quality cut um cut glass um I just hold it up to the light there I don't know if you can see um, I do have Christmas decorations on the window little snow scene there snowflakes icicles but there you go um they are really really nice glasses so I picked up eight of these, so I picked up, I wanted six for um, my six piece play setting, but um, I allowed two for breakages, so these were just 99 pence each, they're quite heavy as well, um, honestly I can't, I can't tell you how good these are for the price of 99 pence each, they're amazing quality, so get yourself some of them. They have the highball glasses as well. So I'll just pick one of these up and show you them in exactly the same design. Now this is called Timeless, this um, design. And I've looked around and they do sell them in the range. They sell them in Asda as well online. But you know what? This glass here, it's the same price as the smaller one of 99 pence. And they are two pound each in Asda. So get yourself to Home Bargains, um, yeah they're amazing quality and as I say they've got a decent weight to them, they're not going to break easily I don't think, you know they're not thin, they're quite a thickish glass. So again I picked up 8 of those, um, as I say 6 from a player set and 2 extra for breakages. Right, now moving on in the same range they have this um, jug, this pitcher jug. Now I think this would be lovely, I mean even now for mulled wine, you know make, put your mulled wine in here, there's your glasses you know for it, um, but also in the summer for cocktails I would do like a lovely um, gin uh, cocktail in here with like herbs and stuff and use these smaller glasses. Uh, so this was only 4 99 I tell you what it is so heavy it's really, really thick, heavy glass. It's amazing, amazing for um for four ninety nine. So I picked up one of those, but I might actually go back and get another one, um because of the amount of glasses I've got. You know, if I have like a a barbecue one day, one day in the in the future, you know, if I have a barbecue, I could have like two jugs, you know, enough to fill up all of the glasses. So I'll probably pop back and get another one of them for four ninety nine. So moving on, I picked up these cookie cutters. Now these were one pound seventy nine, and the little Christmas trees. You get the three different sizes, the metal as well, but they've ha they've got this like plasticky um on the top, this rubbery. What's it like a rubbery thing on the top? You know to protect your hands when you're actually pressing down and using them. So I thought they were really cute to make cookies, and one pound seventy nine. On the same theme, they had the ones, the little chop, uh, what are they? Gingerbread men, sorry. Um, so you can do like, yeah, gingerbread men. These could be shop, you could do shortbread with these ones. But again, in the three different sizes, the same thing. Um, and you know what, I had a, the, I think there was another, another cookie set. Uh, I can't remember what it was. Mm. I honestly can't remember what it was, but I picked up the three that I like, and so this is a snowman, and I absolutely adore snowmen. I just I think they're so fabulous. Um, 
yeah I'm really attracted to snowmen again three different sizes same setup you know so £1.79 um, I picked up a couple of food items so I picked up this cheese and broccoli pasta and sauce by Bachelors um, I think I can't remember how much this was um, I'll just get my receipt and see if I can see it um, that's not that one uh, okay so it's 50 pence so yeah the kids uh, my son Hayden he when he comes in from school he's always really hungry and can't wait for dinner like because we have dinner quite late so I picked it up in the cheese and broccoli I got two of each but he's already ate one and I picked up the cheese um, the cheese leek and ham as well so yeah 50 pence each for those um, moving on I picked up some crisps just the Walker salt and vinegar crisps for his packed lunch um, six packs in there and they were I'm just having a look they were £1.25 for those Cornish pasties Ginsters yeah my other half loves these I like them as well and these were a pound a pack so I picked up two of those moving on I picked up this beautiful butter it's a gorgeous like container you know like a what was it like a kilner kilner jar so it's buttered fudge and in this beautiful beautiful pink tin it's by the Oxfordshire Tea Company and you know you can use this afterwards you can actually use the tin it's even for just you know if you put it in a cabinet or something as decor it's absolutely lovely I'll probably use it to keep craft items in um, but this was £2.49 for this one I believe um, I'm just checking the receipt if I can find it I'm sure it was £2.49 I'll have to come back to that one. Oh. No, it was one ninety nine. Sorry, that was one ninety nine. Uh, yeah, my error one ninety nine for a tin of that. So I, I picked that up and um, picked two up. Actually, I picked up one for my friend Nicola and one for me. And on the similar theme, I picked up the butter shop butter shortbread as well by the same company that. Oxf Oxfordshire Tea Company and these I love the colour of this isn't this so nice like a turquoise green colour I just love it um, this would match in the kitchen actually um, my decor is like oh, like a turquoise greeny colour as well um, so yeah I picked up two of those as well one for me and one for Nicola Luckily, Nicola doesn't watch my videos. I don't even think she knows I do YouTube, to be fair. Um, so she's not going to see this. I'm going to give her these, some of these for Christmas. Um, moving on, again, for um, Nicola, I picked up these Cars Biscuit Selection uh, for cheese. So these were, um, they were, they were one ninety nine for this um, selection. So I'm um, moving on. I picked up this. It's Beko Defense. So it's for alle allergies, hair fever, and I know you think, well, it's winter really, and but you know, dust allergies and the dogs. And I know since I got my decorations out, you know, um, <laughs> a bit dusty from being in storage all all this time. Uh, it set off my allergies a little bit. So and I do have five dogs and a cat and a lot of the dogs are um a hypoallergenic kind of breeds um they do they do sometimes affect me a little so i picked up this um yeah allergy spray and i'm just gonna look on it right so it was 4.99 for that so um moving on I could not resist these. Now, you know, I've got no children in this house, young children. Uh, but, yeah, I, I couldn't resist this. 
it's the little elf footprints now we do have the little elf on the shelf and I thought this was just so cute and you know what I think it's going to be great when um when I finally have grandchildren <laughs> which yeah I haven't got any yet but I thought that would be so cute you know and this was only 49 pence so you would just kind of use I'm guessing spray snow with that um, moving on, I picked up these. I can't wait to try these. Actually, I'm going to try one when I put the camera down. And it's the Bagel Nash. And they are cheese and jalapeno bagels. You get four bagels in here. And they're only a pound. So I picked up those. I also picked up this pulled pork um, for wraps, you know, for my son's packed lunch. Um, and this was 79 pence. I also picked up the uh, chicken tikka breast. So again, these go in wraps for pat lunch. I did pick the wraps up, but I don't know where they've gone. They're probably in the fridge. Um, so yeah, I picked up the little bottles of 7up. And these were, I'm just going to look at, refer to the receipt here. Um, I think they were 59p. You know, when you're looking for something and you just can't find it. Hey, I'm sure they were 59p. I wonder if that's it. 39p, even better. Yeah, 7 up is 39p. And I picked up the Diet Coke, the little bottles of Diet Coke. And this was actually 59p. So 59 and 39p. Again, for pat lunch. My son likes that. Um, I picked up this. Now, oh, God, I... I was absolutely over the moon when I picked up this. It's the Dr. Pawpaw and it's the multi-purpose smoothing, uh, sorry, soothing balm with natu natural pawpaw. Now this costs a lot more money. Um, I picked it up for £2.49 um, in home bargains. But I know uh, like places like the Beauty Bear and you know um other beauty outlets it's around six pound there now they had three different types i picked up this red one and um, they did have like an orangey one and i wished i picked that up now so I, I might need to go back and get that one but you can use it on your lips obviously as a lip balm um and obviously it's tinted hey girls stop the fight please the player fighting in the background um sorry about that but um yeah, you can use it on your cheeks as well as a tint. So, you know, for if you're on your holidays, it's a quick, like, a quick look. Do you know what I mean? Just put a little bit on your cheeks. Hey, girls. I'm just going to wish you around. Hey, stop that play fighting. <laughs> um, yeah, so you can put this on your cheeks, you know, on your lips and have, like, a very quick look when you come off the beach or just for going to the beach so 2 49 for that that's a bargain i picked up this little um north pole stamp set now this i think this was about 149 um hang on i just get my receipt um now what would it be called let us santa letter stamp e i was spot on spot on the money there it it is actually 149 and it's the north pole nail and it's got to and from so it's this lovely wooden block and this is your ink underneath so i think that's great for like stamping on presents so it's you know saving on buying a tag which you know is good for the environment i guess um just to wrap your present you know i'm going to start wrapping mine in brown paper actually um because you can um recycle that i've heard that some christmas paper you can't recycle so i think i'm going to go that way on um and i'm going to just stamp the front of the present with whoever it's for and who it's from so that's that's great one pound 49 for that and oh, sorry i really do apologize for my dogs in the background <laughs> this is mum and daughter hey it's a little puppy, mum and daughter, play a fighting. Hey, Bonnie, Bonnie, Minnie, what are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing, Bonnie? Are you play a fighting with your mummy? Hey, are you play a fighting with your mummy? <laughs> right, getting back to this. Um, 
so I picked up these battery operated LED lights there's 100 lights on here and the multifunction as well so um, I, if whenever I go in Poundland I pick up all of the you know you can get the big packs of the double ear batteries which most things take and yeah you just pop I think it's four double ear batteries in here and they are on a timer as well so they'll you know they'll come on for six hours and, and switch off so yeah i've got these outside the indoor outdoor so but what i do is um i put the little control into hey girls millie millie no millie bonnie no no <laughs> not that they're gonna listen <laughs> so i picked up these lights and um, as i say you can put the little control in a, I put it in a food bag just to offer a little bit of protection from the, you know, the elements. And I took it in and eyed it underneath the um, garland. So these were only five ninety nine a box, and I picked up two of those. So uh, the next item, um, I almost forgot about was this beautiful wicker basket, and it's got lovely handles on the side, as you can see, and it's got this beautiful red corduroy lining. Um, inside and it's got this beautiful kind of um, lace effect with a little button here and I'll just step back so you can have a proper look at it it's very very traditional very very festive and my idea behind this and no <laughs> she, I don't think she will be watching um, I'm gonna you know put some things in this basket to to make a hamper so yeah just build a, a nice sort of christmas festive amber hope for my friend nicola um so this basket was 5.99 so i did think it was 6.99 but when i got to the um checkout yeah she said what's oh, 5.99 so even better so it just makes a lovely you know um because obviously the contents inside is going to be eaten and you've got a nice storage basket you know afterwards um to store whatever you like in really uh, bring it out every year or if you didn't if you wanted to use it all year round you could remove this you know it's easily removed um by just undoing these ties and then you can use it all year round as a basket and come christmas you can just pop this back in and you know it's um it's ready for the festive season right so moving on a poundland um i have picked up this shampoo this lovely um banana set scented shampoo um i have all this before and well it wasn't the banana it was the strawberry and i really really do like it so um i heard a lot of good things about the banana one a couple of you um a couple of uh, my subscribers have said oh do you know did you try the banana one it's really really nice so i picked that up today so i picked up the shampoo and i picked up the the conditioner too now what i like about these is it's got no sls in so it's got no sodium lauryl sulfates it's not going to strip your hair of the oil you know because it's not the harsh degreaser um you know it's not using that sls degreaser in it uh, also there's no parabens as well so there's there's no nasties uh yeah these were a pound each as you would expect in the pound shop but on seeing that some things are not just a pound in the pound shop are they um some things are two pounds and threes and fours and up to five pound but these were only a pound each right moving on um i picked up this patterson's scottish cream shortbread fingers um, you can tell it's Christmas, can't you? Because we all buy the shortbread. And as you can see, I've opened this packet because I had to try it. I was having a, um, a sweet tooth moment. Now, I haven't really got a sweet tooth. Um, I don't really like chocolate that much. Um, and it's really got to take my fancy to eat it. I'm more of a savoury person. So give me a sausage roll. <laughs> or a pasty over like a cake any day you know but um yeah I, I had a sweet sweet tooth moment and i picked up these 
so these were only a pound and they're, they're quite heavy the box eh? it's um 13 almost 13 and a half ounces in here so they, they were a pound i picked up um this oh land of nod and the, it's a bath bar so you just crumble crumble a piece of, piece of it off pop it in your bath and this is in lavender so it's you know lavender calms calms you um so if you're feeling a bit stressed have a lavender bath now from what i understand they do do a range in this so i did say like the bubble bath but i didn't bother picking that one up because i had this this has got like little lavender you know you can see the lavender on there as well lavender flowers um they do a pillow mist and i'm really interested in getting that but my store didn't have it in so i'll be on the lookout for that but this smells absolutely lovely i mean until i'm getting old like because um years ago i couldn't stand the smell of lavender um but now i love it it must be an age thing guys do you think <laughs> that's what i'm saying <laughs> it's got to be an age thing because i actually do like it now and i've got a little lavender air plant outside as well so when i go past i like grab well not now it's a kind of dying off now but when i go past i kind of grab it to, um to release like this the fragrance of it it's it's lovely so yeah that was a pound and moving on there's a theme here isn't there look this one I'm missing oh <gasps> do you know what i love fries um, chocolate cream the original and I've never even seen this one before it's the raspberry cream you get three bars in here for a pound and I couldn't wait to open it I really couldn't I was in the car and I was waiting for David he popped in into the shop and um, yeah I just dove on in there <laughs> and um, I've, I've warned everybody because there's other chocolate that I buy for the other, you know, people who live in this house, me or me family, yes. That's that's what they call family alien. <laughs> the people that live in this house. <laughs> and my family. So yeah, um I've warned them not to touch this one. This is mine. <laughs> but it's um it's raspberry and it's dark chocolate. Now if I do eat chocolate, I do tend to eat the, the dark chocolate. So three for a pound brilliant i can't wait to eat another bag actually <laughs> and moving on you'll see another theme here <laughs> yep it's open <laughs> so these are the doritos in the flame grilled steak flavor and i had to open them just to let you know what they're like because i've never had them before um and i can see they're nice they're really nice uh yeah I, I mean i didn't even dip them you know again i was in the car <laughs> waiting for david i was having a right little picnic in the car <laughs> so um yeah i opened them and i was just uh, yeah I, I ate a few but i did i did leave some you know just because i wanted to try them with a dip as well they're really nice without the dip to be fair so yeah these were a pound as well and you know what i didn't even realize they were doritos you know i picked them up i saw flame grilled steak and i thought oh crisps so i picked them up I, i've done this before in Poundland. you know i think and that the, the crisps and they haven't been they've been like some doritos or or thins or whatever but uh yeah the the go the brilliant um i think they'd go nice with like a i don't know cheese and onion chive or something deep so yes i'll pick one of those up and i'll have them um so yes moving on I, as i said i went to b and m and i picked up again you can tell it's christmas i picked up these candy canes and they are these are in the peppermint flavor so the a pound and you get well, I don't know how many go in there. Two, four, six, eight, ten. You get twelve. You get twelve little candy canes. Now I used to hang these on the tree when the kids were small. Um, I don't hang them on the tree anymore. I'm going to use these in a a hot chocolate station. You know, I think they're really nice for like to use as stirrers rather than using a spoon. You can use the stick. Um, so yeah, um. That's what, what I'm going to use these for. You can get them in different flavours as well. So this was peppermint. I can't even remember what the flavours were. Uh, oh, berries. I remember seeing a berry one. Um, but I picked up the peppermint. So yes, a pound for them. And I picked up this little house as well. I'll just pan back so you can see it. 
it's got like the lovely glitter roof and the little bits of foliage and uh, I thought I picked it up because it looks a bit similar to my house <laughs> um well no it actually doesn't Dylan. it will look similar to my house <laughs> um but yeah I, I love the uh, doorway you know the double fronted thing on it it looks like a proper you know I, how I drew houses when I was a kid <laughs> so anyway yeah it's got these like little windows at the side as well and I've popped some batteries in um oh yes I picked up right just one moment Right, so in Poundland, I picked up two packs of these batteries as well. Sorry, I just to put them in the drawer there. Um, two pound a pack for 30. I, I got the double A's. I go through these, you know, ugh, God, all the time. Every time I go in Poundland, I pick these up. I think they're brilliant value, <clears throat> um, especially with Christmas here, because these take like this. I think this one takes two batteries. And I've got other things that take, like the batteries, fairy lights and things. So I am going to be blitzing through these packs. Um, so there you go, this like lovely little little house, isn't it? So cute. Um, there you go. I do have a, a church one as well, which I picked up from the range last year. So uh, they match quite, quite well, you know. Um, I'll, I'll show you the church. So guys, this is a church that I picked up from um, the range last year. Uh, I do believe they've still got them in. I'm sure I saw them this year. So I can't remember where I paid for it though. That's the only problem. Um, so it's it's really tall, hey? That's it. I'm going to pan back a bit. Well, there's the little house. Uh, so you can see how tall it is. It's really, really tall. You know what? Fifteen, fifteen ninety nine seems to be sticking in my head, but I'm really not sure. But they do still sell them, so yeah. And I think that matches really, really well. But these are definitely in store in B and M, and the range does have other like houses in the, on this theme as well. So yeah. Okay. Um. I guess that's the end of the haul, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, if you have, please give me the thumbs up. And, um, you know, if you've got time, drop me a comment in the comment section below. I love reading your comments, you know. Um, and, yeah, until the next time, I'm going to leave this video and say bye-bye for now. And stay, stay safe, everyone. Bye-bye.